It is being called one of the biggest fires Spokane has seen in quite some time. Yesterday, a four alarm fire ripped through an apartment complex on the Lower South Hill, giving people just seconds to get out. We brought you the breaking news during our five o'clock newscast last night as flames shot up in the sky and smoke blanketed the area. KXY 4's Kylie Cruz was there as 75 firefighters frantically worked to put the fire out. She joins us now live with an update tonight. Kylie. Good evening, Nadine. Yeah, fire crews have left the area a short while ago, and now we're seeing residents come back. They're surveying the damage done in their apartment. We've got cleanup crews. We've also got restoration crews. Folks have been bringing down clothes and mattresses, other personal belongings that would be able to be salvaged. Now, fire investigators right now think that the likely cause of this fire was because of electrical issues with the apartment's attic. And while thousands of dollars of personal belongings have been lost, people are just thankful that everyone made it out safely. 24 hours after flames torched the Tico apartments yesterday afternoon. This is the aftermath. One day later, the destruction, the damage shown in all this rubble. You're standing on the top floor, uh, far west side of the apartments. Four units destroyed. Most of the others sustained water and smoke damage. $1.2 million to be exact. When you have a fire of this magnitude, it weakens all the structural numbers. We bring in water or foam or whatever the extinguishing agent is. It, it has an impact on everything. The fire started in the attic and rapidly spread across the complex. Since the, the entire attic was one unoccupied space, there were no fire stops, there were no walls that acted as barriers to confine the fire to one section or the other. 16 units were on the front lines, battling the fire, ventilating the roof, doing whatever they could to stop the fire from spreading. See the real heavy charring up on the top of the door, and it gets lighter, lighter, lighter. Fires uh, typically so start from the ground and go up. But this um, one started this, from the top and quickly moved here, down. Here. The fire grew exponentially, and then as it consumed all the fuel and all the oxygen above us, then it started dropping. The west side of the apartment suffered the most damage. But as fire crews surveyed the mess the fire left, they're thankful things are a little better than they seem. This fire could have been worse. I mean, it could have been much worse if it wasn't for the aggressiveness of the firefighters getting on the roof and uh, fighting their way up, up into this area.